Well, good afternoon. I'm Leah Lando. Mark is off today. The man who shot a Rochester police officer back in 2009 has been arrested again. Tyquan Rivera was just 14 years old when he shot Rochester police officer Anthony DePonzio on Dayton Street. The now 25-year-old is facing drug-related charges. And Josh Navarro is live from the newsroom with more on this. Josh? Leah, Tyquan Rivera and four other co-defendants under arrest in part of a narcotics surveillance investigation that was started by New York State Police for months ago. Rivera pleaded not guilty in city court this morning to two counts of criminal sale of a controlled substance in the third degree. Now, according to court papers, Rivera sold fentanyl in 60 envelopes to two undercover officers in two separate sales. Rivera recently was released on parole from his previous conviction. Prosecutors say that his previous conviction has no bearing in this particular case. We spoke with the assistant district attorney right after. Here's what he had to say. Anytime you you know arrest somebody who's alleged to be involved in, in narcotics trafficking, it's it's significant. Uh, you know, there's there's uh, obviously an opioid epidemic that this community is, is facing, and so you know even if it's one at a time, you know when we can take somebody uh, off the street, so to speak, who's alleged to you know be providing these uh, dangerous narcotics to people, it's it's a good thing. Now, Rivera's bail is set at $25,000 cash or $100,000 bond. He faces a maximum of 15 years in prison if convicted. The other folk, uh, four co-defendants are charged with possession of drugs. They are all due back in city court on Monday. Live in the newsroom, Josh Navarro, News 8.